Hey guys, this is CG Animator, and today I'm going to show you how to add soft bodies to the game engine. So before I get started, please rate and comment this tutorial, this video, and check out my other videos and tutorials, and check out my channel. Be sure to comment or message me if you have any questions or want me to do a certain tutorial. And uh, yeah, keep watching my videos. So this is Blender 2.48. If you don't have it, I suggest you get it okay so let's get started so the first thing you want to do is going to edit mode with this present tab press w subdivide and sub subdivide it three times that's good i go in the game engine add a plane scale it up right there is good and bring it down so right now if we press p nothing happens but if we press Q, go here, and change it from static to soft body, and press P, then it acts as a soft body. But that wasn't very, you know, it didn't look too good. But if here we can put down the stiffness. If we put it to one, it'd be just like having a rigid body. And if we put it down to about 0.14, sorry, and press P to play starting to look even better and if you put this down to let's say 0 0.015 this one here so if we put these this one to about 0.4 I'm just going to put it at 0.15 that could be exact and we put this to 0 0.015 and we press P then you get a pretty cool effect now if I were to just end the tutorial right now that'd be kind of boring so I'm going to show you how to pretty much shoot rigid bodies out in the game engine. So first thing you want to do is name it. Press N to bring out the transform properties. I'm gonna name this soft. Make sure it's not capital. We'll see you later. And press M to move and move it to the second layer right here. And you can access it again by pressing these layers. But this is the second layer. Go back to the first layer and I'll add in empty. Turn this off so you can see better. You can turn this off with a little hand here. Now you can see X, Y, and Z here. These are the axes that it goes on. Bring this over here and I'm going to rotate this down a little bit. Now you want to add a sensor, controller, and an actuator. And you want to link these by just holding one of these and dragging it to the other one and letting go and this connects it. You want to turn this to keyboard always in the keyboard and then at key click it and press space. Instead of motion you want to go to edit object and it's already on that object. Now the object that you want it to add is going to be the cube that we named soft. Make sure you don't have it on caps lock. That's on the uh, uh, capital letter everything's small so now we want it to shoot out at a certain speed we don't just want it to drop so these are the different uh, axes it goes on this is x y and z we want it to go on the y axis since the y axis is pointing that way as you can see here Hold on. goes that way so let's try eight I press P. I'll give it a second. My computer slows down when I have this uh, program on. So I press space and then the soft body comes out of the empty. The empty is invisible in the game engine. So I press it again. Another one comes out. And the only problem with with this is that if they touch each other, they kind of freak out a little bit. But it's not this slow all the time. It's just this slow because I have this program running. And you can make cool games with that, you know, different things. I don't know what you could use it for in in a real object game where you, there's a real objective. But you know, it's cool for fun games. And um, that's all there is to this one. You can mess around with certain things. 
and um, this is CG Animator. Please, you know, comment and rate. And thanks for watching.